The following question reads that the graph shows trends in four physical properties of elements in period 3 excluding argon. Which graph has electronegativity on the y axis? So this is the this is the y axis and this uh, represents the electronegativity of the element. Electronegativity of an element is the tendency for an atom uh, or element to gain electrons. So I'm going to open the periodic table. So this is my periodic table and I'm going to look at period 3 which is this one. Sodium, magnesium, aluminium, silicon, phosphorus, sulfur, chlorine. Remember electronegativity or the tendency for an atom to gain electrons increases to the right. The reason why it increases to the right is that the number of protons increases. Sodium has 11 protons so the attraction for electrons is not very great. But as you move to the right you can see that the number of protons for example, phosphorus has 15 protons, chlorine has 17 protons. So the number of protons on nuclear charge increases. And if you have more nuclear charge, there's going to be more attraction for electrons. So remember, electronegativity always increases to the right of the periodic table. So, so elements on the right side, chlorine, sulfur, they're going to be more electronegative, which is also true. You would notice that chlorine always forms a negative ion. The elements on the left hand side are going to be less electronegative. So sodium is the one that's always losing electrons instead of gaining electrons. It's never gaining electrons, it's always losing electrons. And as you move to the right, elements have a higher tendency to gain electrons. So the correct graph for this particular question, it's going to be option D. That as you move to the right of the periodic table, the tendency for an atom to gain electrons or the electronegativity is also going to increase. Sodium would be the least electronegative and chlorine would be the most electronegative in the group. So y-axis represents electronegativity. So this is the graph that you should obtain uh, if you want to plot electronegativity versus PD3 elements.